Denny, not exactly stagnant is the word local car dealers use to describe the electric car market, but industry experts say the state's efforts to boost it could help in time. What's it sound like once you start her up? Uh, it sounds like nothing. Bill Dessler may be the president of RIT, but as a Volt owner, today he was more like a pitch man for hybrid and electric cars. It's been fantastic, actually. It's been bug free, uh, zero problems, 165 miles average per gallon. RIT has charging stations, and through the state's Charge NY program, plans to add more. Yeah, I think that for, for people who choose this kind of transportation, it'll make life more convenient. It'll Governor Cuomo recently announced a $2 million program to boost the use of electric cars in the state. An industry expert with the U of R Business School tells me that one of the problems many consumers have with electrics, despite the fact they've been on the road for several years, many see them as too new. There's also the hefty upfront cost, often thousands of dollars more than comparable cars fueled by gasoline. I never really thought about it too much, but just the whole idea of the battery. Uh, I just didn't care for how much work and resources were used to make a battery, and then you got to charge it and all that shenanigans. Alan Egan of Webster wants a new vehicle, but has no use for an electric car, or the rush to spend $2 million to recharge the market. Yeah, it seems like a lot goes to, into it, and uh, if customers don't want to buy it, I guess, then, you know, why try putting incentives out there? It's supposed to work by itself, right? While automakers are pouring far more cash into making electric car batteries go further, some problems remain. For, you know, the, the cars like the Leaf or the Tesla, you know, you can run out of the battery, and if you do, you're stranded. So, so I think that what you want to do is you want to have enough charging stations around such that you don't have to worry about those. Now, managers for O'Connor Chevrolet and Hoselton Nissan both say that sales of electric cars have been sluggish this summer. Other parts of the market locally are heating up. A Canandaigua company that provides charging stations is adding six to the RIT campus and also helping add more charging stations in the city of Rochester. Don and